You randomly pick three Smarties from an opaque paper bag containing nine Smarties, six yellow, and three blue. You select the Smarties one at a time without replacing any of the Smarties. Presumably, you're eating them. What is the probability of drawing one yellow and two blue Smarties in any order? Fill in the probabilities in the text boxes on the probability tree below, and also fill in the total probability in the big blue text box. To get a yellow Smarty, we have six out of nine are yellow. We have a six, nine chance, so six out of nine. Then a blue. You no longer have nine Smarties, you have eight Smarties, and three are blue, so three out of eight. On the last, you no longer have eight Smarties, but now you have seven, and only two are blue, two out of seven. To figure out that probability, I'm going to multiply. Remember, we always multiply when we're going down the branches this way, multiply. Then when you want to figure out the total probabilities, when we go this way, Way, we add. Add the probabilities and we go down this way. We have 6 ninths times 3 eighths times 2 sevenths. 6 out of 9 times 3 out of 8 times 2 out of 7. 3 goes into 6 twice. 3 goes into 9 3 times. 3 goes into 3 once. 3 goes into 3 once. 2 goes into 2 once. 2 goes into 8 4 times. 2 goes into 2 once. 2 goes into 4 twice. On the top, we have 1 times 1 times 1, which is 1. On the bottom, in the denominator, we have 2 times 7, which is 14. The probability of getting yellow, blue, blue is 1 out of 14. 1 out of 14. That means this is going to be 1 out of 14 as well. We're going to prove it. Once you've been doing this for a while, and you see that they're all going to be the same, then you don't have to prove it each time. For now, the first few times, just prove it. 3 are blue out of 9, then yellow. We have six or yellow out of eight. Then blue, we only have two blue because we've already taken this blue. So two out of seven. We have three out of nine times six out of eight times two out of seven equal two. Three goes into three once. Three goes into nine three times. Three goes into three once. Three goes into six twice. Two goes into two once. Two goes into eight four times. Two goes into two once. Two goes into four twice. On the top, everything is canceled. So it's one times one times one, which is one. On the bottom, we have two times seven is 14. One fourteenth as predicted. The last one, three out of nine are blue. We've taken a blue, so you only have two left. So two out of eight, which can reduce to one quarter. I tend not to reduce here, just so I can see the nine, eight, seven pattern. Yellows, I have six out of seven are yellow. When we multiply that, we're gonna get one fourteenth as well. We have three out of nine for our first fraction, times two out of eight for our second fraction, times six out of seven for our third fraction. Three goes into nine three times. Three goes into three once. Three goes into six twice. Two goes into, well, I can just cancel like that. That's four. Four goes into eight twice. Two times seven is 14 on the bottom. We have one on the top. All together, you have one fourteenth chance of getting yellow, blue, blue. You have a one fourteenth, one in 14 chance of getting blue, yellow, blue. You have a one in 14 chance of getting blue, blue, and yellow. All together, that's three of them. Three fourteenths of a chance. Our total probability is three out of 14, and you could put that as a decimal, rounded to five decimal places, or a percent, rounded to five decimal places, and then press enter to see if you're right. All right, and that's how you do a level seven type question. Have a good day.